Mark, quick turnaround. Torquay on Tuesday. What's thoughts ahead of the game? Yeah, it can't come quick enough. Um, we need to get back out on that pitch as quick as we can and uh, right, right some wrongs. Um, we'll always be hard on ourselves. There is some positives to come out of it. We created chances. Now it's about executing those chances, which has been our, our downfall. Um, it's managing the whole game, second in, second out. It's having that concentration and that focus, but it's also having that desire, that fight and that heart because we are scrapping for our lives now. Um, we, we've got to embrace this challenge and be excited by it, not, not run away from it. This, this is life. Life is tough. Um, tough times make tough people. And we've got, we've got to use this now to everything, the adversity and the um, people are rightly questioning us at the moment. We've got to come up with answers and quickly. Of course, obviously, Saturday's game saw us have two, uh, well, two returns. Obviously, Ethan Ross made his debut, Kev Locko played 90 minutes. And maybe how's Lewis Kinsella doing just as we update on those? Yeah, big positives on all, all three of those. Uh, Locko, first 90 minutes. Ethan Ross coming in for his first game, first time he met everyone today due to him having a, having a baby in the week. Um, I thought it was yeah, a real commanding performance from him. Um, Kinsella starting to be on the training pitch now. We need him back as quick as we can, but also need to be careful that he comes back and stays back. So, you know, there's probably one other player coming into the building shortly as well. So we've got, we've got players coming, coming back and two players who played today will be stronger for it. So there's certainly positives in and around in, in what was a very frustrating afternoon in our previous game. But um, that one's gone now. It's all about the next game. It's all about getting back on the horse and answering, answering those questions and coming up with answers and solutions. I suppose having two away games in a week obviously gives us a chance to go to someone else's place and ruin their day and maybe you know, look for a response from Saturday's game. Yeah, I, I, I like that and we've got to twist it on that. We're, we're, we're going away from home now. Uh, people probably are writing us off now and, write, and you know, I can understand why. But we, we've got to you know, roll our sleeves up now. It's backs against the wall. It's, I'm looking around to see who's with me now and who's ready for this fight. Of course, obviously, Torquay, looking at them, obviously, this point result for them on Saturday. When they played at our place, it was a last-minute free kick from Kins and an opportunity to prove things right, as you say. Yeah, and look, we provided a fantastic moment in the game and I'm looking for someone to provide that for us now. And that's going to take, you know, it's going to take minerals, it's going to take a deep alloy and soedja of steel to um, stand up and be counted now and, and produce those moments when, when we need them, but also to keep strong and our structure strong at all times as well because we're going to have to be a tough nut to crack and we're going to have to fight and we're going to have to scrap and then when we get our chance we need, we need, we need to make the most of them. So that's the final step isn't it? Obviously we made the chances on Saturday, had the opportunities and now it's all about putting the ball in the back of the net and winning the game. Yeah absolutely and it only takes a moment in football to change the whole feeling and um, that was certainly the case of Saturday. We should have changed our season on Saturday, we didn't. We fluffed our lines, you know, we missed our opportunity. Um, fortunately, there's another opportunity right around the corner and uh, we can't waste it. And just with Torquay, what are you expecting from them? A, a really tough game. You know, Gary Johnson, utmost respect for him and everything he's done in the game and the teams that he's produced. Um, you know, he's turned their fortunes around uh, very quickly this season after a successful season last season. Um, yeah, yeah, it's going to be a really, really tough game. Another big challenge, but one we've got to meet head on and not... not no, 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 no retreat, no surrender. It's about front foot, you know, putting our best foot forward and and turning up and being counted. I suppose as well, you learn a lot from the players that play from Saturday. And now we'll look for a response on Tuesday as well and see how they react to it as well. Yeah, so it's all about reaction. You know, it's another opportunity. We we got to react now. We um, you know, we've got to react. We've got to keep pushing. Are you in the shop? Look below for more information. Click here for the next video, click here to subscribe.